In this video, I'm going to show you how you can play on RuneScape private servers that are client-based 718 uh, and above. So if you're a Mac user, uh, a lot of people might come into this issue where they can only play their private servers on safe mode or they can't even load it, the client crashes, it closes, when you press auto setup it just seems to close. You've probably tried to reinstall the, re sorry, reinstall the, ca the cache client folder rather, you've reinstalled um, Java, and you've restarted your computer, you've you've tried everything haven't you but no one on the internet seems to have the answer. So this is what you're going to do. This has fit work for me after configuring this thing for a long time. Okay, I spent many hours trying to fix this. So my issue was personally when I would press on auto run setup for the graphics settings my client would close, forcing me to play in fixed screen low graphics safe mode. Okay, with capped FPS. But now I'm able to play with max FPS HD. So let's get into it. Okay, so first, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to un uninstall the Java version that you have installed from the Java website. Okay, the problem with Mac is that it has its own Java. So you don't want to install Java from Java's uh, Java.com. So go on Google, type in how to uninstall Java on Mac. Follow the steps. Okay, it's very simple. I'll even show you. Okay. So right here, what I've highlighted, this is these are the steps you're going to take in order to uninstall your Java. I know in, on Mac, when you delete an app, it doesn't fully, I say quote, fully delete the app because there's still like files of it left over on your PC. So if you follow these steps on this website and you still see that it's not uninstalled your, your Java, click on the spotlight search, type in Java, okay? For me, I'm not going to do this because I already have the version I, ha I have working. You will highlight everything and just delete. Anything related to Java will be deleted. Okay? And then you will have no Java on your system. To confirm this, type in terminal, which is CMD for Windows, similar thing. And you want to type here Java uh, space slash uh, dash, sorry, version. Okay, so as you can see, I'm running on Java version 1.6. It's just called Java 6, that's what people call it. So 1.6, this is the version you're going to want, and I'm going to show you now in a moment. But essentially, when you do this, after uninstalling all your Javas, you're going to see no Java found, and you'll get a little pop-up here saying you need, to un you need to install a Oracle Java SDK or something like that. Okay, so next, after you've uninstalled everything, you're fresh. What you're going to want to do is go onto this link here which I'm going to put in the pinned comments below and in the description box and you're going to want to download this Java for OS X. The problem is with Mac OS uh, Catalina which is the latest one, let me show you guys, with the latest uh, Mac OS, um, the Java that the RSPS uses and in this case I'm playing Blisscape but if you use any sort of 718 client it still works the same way that client itself for Mac uses Java 6, okay, which expired over three years ago in 2017. When you use latest Java to write, try and run that game, it causes issues because it's trying to use the, it's trying to run configuration from the latest Java on something outdated. The client is running on Java 6. You see what I mean? So um, what you need to do is obviously get Java 6, which is compatible with the client that you're playing, which is 718 allowing you to then configure your graphics and many numerous other things that you're having issues with will miraculously be gone okay so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to install this link which you'll find in the comments and so on this is from apple's website this is the apple version of java it's called apple java you don't want oracle java you want apple java okay problem is i'm not going to download it now but because it's very self-explanatory how to download things but problem with this is that when you press download and you go through the setup it's going to say Java, the newest version of Java already found on system and it won't allow you to continue. So a lot of you might have tried this um, and you know, you're not able to download this Java 6. So what I found, a fix, luckily I came across this website, is that um, when Catalina came out, which is the latest OS, um, Apple did not allow people to thinking of my words here, Apple did not allow people on this Catalina to download Java 6. It was no longer allowed. So that's why you get that message, not allowed to download Java 6 um, 
new version detected and it will just close the launcher after you download it. So what you want to do is use this little loophole I found and I'm really glad for this website. So I'm going to put it on the, the pinned comments as well. You're going to want to follow the instructions here, very, very self-explanatory. I I've pretty much read it myself and did it. But essentially in case you know you need it very simple, just follow the steps one to seven, okay? And what's, what this is going to do, it's going to run a script that is going to allow the system to bypass that not allowed to download Java 6 nonsense and allow you to download this. And then when you're done, you don't have to restart or anything. You want to go back to terminal, type in uh, Java version again. And instead of it saying Java not found because of, you know, you uninstalled it, it should now say Java 1.6. Great. Now you launch the, launch the client. So let's have a little test. Okay. I've only had this working for a, about an hour now, actually. I made this this morning. Okay, so this is the client I play, Blisscape. If, anyone, if you are looking for a good private server, definitely join Blisscape. So you'll notice when you first launch the client, um, the first time after doing all these instructions, it would take about half an hour to an hour to load the cache and then fetch the updates. But once it's done, like it's done the first time, and every other time you launch the client and everything else, it will be really fast. All right, now I'm gonna log in and show you the magic, okay? So, let's just logging in here. I had to restart my cache, but here we go. Look, so HD graphics. Um, I'm running on OpenGL. I'm running on high graphics, and I'm just gonna configure it real quick and turn the sound off. Give me a second. There we go, and everything works. See, there you go. Oh, putting anti and lazing on, and we can do fixed screen. Let's do fixed screen. Don't worry about the red stuff, it goes away once you drag the screen out. And just do an FPS test. Display FPS. There you go, 50 FPS. You see? Open Geo, high graphics, all the settings turned on, and maximum FPS. I have a 27 inch monitor, so the more I drag the screen to make it bigger, the more FPS I lose. But uh, if you have a smaller monitor, then don't worry, you're not going to lose as much frames. But 50 is the max anyway, so look, it's pretty much capped out there. And uh, yeah, everything works as normal. So, hope that helped, and uh, enjoy your HD Mac gameplay.